Alright there guys, it's Adrian here from I Am Jador TV and I haven't done one of these videos so I thought I'd do one today and my bag isn't usually this messy, I'd have just opened it up <laughs> so don't worry about that but what I'm going to do, this is a basically a, obviously you've seen the title, just a what's in my camera bag I thought I'd update you because I've, I've probably updated my camera bag since I started this channel several times and I haven't done one so I'm going to start with what's outside of the bag so this is my reflector that I use it's X-Pro RF152 I think I don't know if I've got this off of it's either Amazon or eBay I think it was Amazon I'm going to pro I'll provide all the links to what I've got and everything uh, below but yeah it's a uh, double sided so it's got the uh, gold side and it's got the silver side and obviously you can unzip that and it has just the sort of like a diffuser through the middle so it's pretty handy it's a portable size one I just hook it onto my bag when I'm doing this if I know it's bright outside and I need one just hook it onto my bag so that's that also if I can get it out with one hand if I'm vlogging I usually take this with me I usually keep it on the side of my bag anyway very good hasn't broken on me uh, it did have like a foam sort of top on here but I took it off because I didn't really want it to get sticking to my camera but this was very inexpensive I think it was less than 20 pounds or 20 US dollars and I know people with Joby Gorilla Pods which are 100 plus are very expensive and the bobbles that they have like this this is not a bobble this is just foam and it, but this is like a one straight long underneath here but the, the Joby's are individual like balls and everyone I know that's got a Joby spent a lot of money they always pop off so this hasn't yet very strong very sturdy link below uh, so yeah if I'm vlogging I'll usually take this with me <clears throat> and into the bag so what I've got here is this is usually in this part here but this is a wire I take this with me because obviously it's a charge up for uh, it's like basically an Android charger or a USB connect connector for whatever you want to call it but it fits my phone because I have an Android I'm filming this from Samsung S6 I film this on also obviously fits into my camera as well and what I usually use this with is what I never leave without is my portable charger very good holds the charge it will charge my phone several times also charge the camera very very must have I believe for all mirrorless uh, well Sony mirrorless I don't know what connectivity the rest have so I'm just going to say Sony for now for all the Sony people mirrorless uh, is a must have to have in here especially you don't want your phone dying you can't contact your models you know you need to contact the models um, and yeah camera as well so yeah this wire and the um, battery pack here put that to the side and again if I'm vlogging this is the Tacstar legendary uh, Tacstar shotgun microphone this is the SGC598 this is very very good and gives the roads a run for its money I had a, I have a well, I had a road uh, I think it was a cheaper one I believe but it was still 49 pounds the tax store is 20 something pounds again link below and this quality is much better than the the, the entry road which is more than twice the price of this and I, uh, the road I had didn't even have any external features you literally just plug in and that's it this is much more powerful it takes one AA battery obviously you've got the 10 uh, plus 10 decibels here and uh, I forgot what that switch does I think it's like a I'm not really even quote because I don't want to get it on and get slated in the comments but again I'll put a link below because I've, I've literally had this for so long I read what it did when I first got it and I keep it at the switch below 
but I'm definitely in the comments I will definitely update what that button does do I think it's for something like clearer sound something like that but yeah it's got plus 10 dB so you put your in recording uh, down to probably like plus, like plus 5 and you leave that up, up to 10 dB here for cleaner sound very 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 good most of my videos all of my videos that you'll, you'll uh, hear the quality from would be with this unless stated otherwise of course uh, what should we go to next I've got a lot of covers in here because my lenses are on uh, lens cloth I mean this is for Ray-Ban but you know it does the same job always have one of those in here this is obviously a plug I never leave out this as well if I have uh, access to a plug I'll use the Sony official Sony uh, charger and I'll plug it in that's if obviously if I don't have one then obviously I'll use the battery pack this is the cheapest 85 <laughs> millimeter that you'll probably find this is probably about 89 pounds on Amazon this is a Nikon mount I don't know if they do a Sony E mount this is a manual focus but this is a Nikon mount and I have the adapter right here it fits right onto my Sony I used it on my first A7 and now it works perfectly on my A7 III I took an excellent shot which probably got the most likes on my page so definitely check that out on my page and I will specify in the comment that I used it. This is the Opteca, uh, Opteca 85mm 1.8. If this was autofocus, it would probably be the, probably the best 85 you could get. But obviously the price wouldn't be as low, so I'd definitely be upgrading to an autofocus one soon. And uh, there's nothing left to show you other than... Oh yes, there is. Sorry, psych. There's all the stuff that's in here. This is, of course, you can see what it does. This is like a sun catcher. Obviously, in the light, you can see what it's doing to the bag <laughs> right there. That's exactly what it does. As you can see, the effect, shine it on the model's face. You're going to get an excellent, excellent um, effect, as you can see it behind there. Uh, this is a CPL, so this is what uh, is going to take the reflection out of glass or uh, water. We've actually had a summer this time in London, so this has been grateful for the skies as it creates that extra detail in the sky. So when you see, instead of having a blown out sky, you're going to have a crisp blue sky with the clouds all defined. That's what this does, it's very great, very helpful for us in the shots. Well, check out my page and see, definitely see uh, some shots of this. Very inexpensive as well. Again, link below. Uh, plug as well for the uh, Android charger or uh, camera charger. Uh, well, of course, can't be a portrait photographer, you know, without a prism. Again, you probably know what prism effect does. If you haven't checked my channel down below, you definitely see some prism shots, editing tutorials as well. Uh, what's there? There's nothing left in here. Just a little wire. Again, another one, extra USB to plug in. And, of course, a new. Oh, this is heavy. I forgot how heavy this was. New. Uh, Sony A7 III of course with my trusty Samyang 35 this is my setup and 99.9% .9 is what I use for all of my shots on my page works like a dream I'm definitely gonna have a review on this so stay tuned for that but yeah and uh, I have uh, I haven't got in this in my bag right now because I've taken them all out but I have about six extra memory cards that I use as well. Put that there. 
but yeah, that's what I have in my bag. So um, I have to put this all back now. <laughs> but that's literally what my bag looks like as of watch up as of the date of making this video. That's what I have in my bag. I will do an update again in the end of the year or even next year to see if any changes. But that is it. I'm gonna have a review of this bad boy uh, in Italy very very soon. So definitely will stay tuned for that. Definitely like, comment, subscribe. What do you have in your camera bag? What is your pick like pick up and go sort of bag? Um, what accessories do you have? Comment everything that you use below. I'd definitely love to know. Uh, definitely for give me a follow on Instagram to check out all the equipment I what I do uh, with this equipment. So definitely check out my Instagram. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.